Hello and welcome back to Friday Minis. Now, I can't believe I haven't actually talked about this before, but today we're going to take a look at how and why you can actually use your headphones in reverse as a microphone. Let's begin with how we can actually do this. And in fact, it's extremely simple. Take your headphones or earbuds or whatever other listening device you have, take that and plug it into the mic port of your computer. Of course, if you have any other recording device, as long as you have a mic input, you can do the same. Simply speak into either side of the speaker and you realize that, well, the sounds you make are actually recorded. In fact, here's me just doing that with, you know, the pair of headphones that I just recently reviewed. And you can see that, well, it does kind of work. So there you go, I'm basically speaking into this pair of headphones. And yeah, I'm speaking into both sides right now. So of course, you're hearing this sound quite evenly in both your ears. But I can of course just talk into one side. And obviously my voice will sound louder in that particular side I'm talking in. So this isn't just a way to, you know, have a microphone. This is a stereo microphone. So yeah, just a cool little trick. So the question is, how does this work? In fact, as it turns out, a speaker is extremely similar to a microphone. The way things are physically set up is this. You have an electrical coil. Suspended inside it is a magnet attached to a diaphragm. When we send an alternating current down that coil, what it does is it creates an alternating magnetic field and that basically moves the magnet and the diaphragm around. And that causes movements in air that our ears can pick up as sound. So that essentially is how you use this setup to generate sound. In other words, use it as a speaker. But here's the deal. When you actually speak into the diaphragm, essentially what you're doing is you're using your voice to vibrate the diaphragm and also the magnet, which is suspended inside the coil. Now, what happens when you move a magnet inside a coil? You induce a little bit of current. This current then runs down the wire all the way down to your 3.5 mm jack. So if you have that plugged into a mic port, well, that alternating current you've just created is in fact the sound itself, which can be picked up by a recording device. And there you have it. That is how you can use headphones or earbuds as a microphone. And in fact, you can do it, you know, anytime you actually need it. Of course, the sound quality isn't great, but hey, if you need to record something in a pinch, you have a solution. That's all there is for this episode of Friday Minis. I hope you gained some insight today. But until next time, you're watching 0612 TV. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, consider checking out the rest of my work on my channel. Alternatively, you may be interested in a playlist of all the other episodes of Friday Minis. If you'd like to show me some monetary support, I am on Patreon. You can find a link to my campaign in the video description. Of course, you can simply like this video or leave a comment. I'll be sure to respond as soon as I can. To keep in touch with my future uploads, do subscribe to this channel. And for even more updates, check out the official Twitter account for this channel at 0612TV. Thank you for your support.